But if you're cold-blooded, you rely on a daily dose of sun to warm up your insides. So reptiles and insects generally fare better in the cold when they're small. Some species, though, just can't help but defy convention. Remember the gargantuan bird-eating cricket of the Kalahari? Well, it has a distant cousin that beats it hands down in the size stakes. This colossal beast is the mountain stone wetter. An insect that's grown as big as a mouse. For one simple reason. Wetters evolved back when there were no native mammals. So they took the ecological niche normally reserved for small rodents and matched them for size. Being a massive insect is fine when it's warm, but this monster species lives high in New Zealand's Southern Alps. It had to evolve a way to survive being big in the cold by doing something no other insect this large can. Even in the shelter of a cave, it can be below freezing. When ice sets in around it, this ingenious hulk of an insect does something very strange indeed. It freezes itself to death, nearly. This wetter species actually encourages ice to form in its body. Ice crystals are sharp. If they form inside a cell, they'd tear through the membrane like razor blades in a balloon. So the key to survival is to ensure ice only forms outside its cells. First, the wetter dehydrates the cells, drawing water out. There, the combination of water and special proteins trigger the formation of ice crystals. In this state of suspended animation, a mountain stone wetter can survive temperatures as low as minus 10 degrees Celsius. An extraordinary 80% of its body can be frozen solid. When temperatures rise and the ice thaws, a wetter can gradually re-enter the land of the living. 